Report, Top Democrat Hands Trump Historic Victory, He's Regretting His Huge Mistake. This past Thanksgiving, we should all thank our lucky stars, and God Almighty, that Donald Trump is in the White House. Not just because he is a smart, decisive leader who is making America great again. And not just because he is rolling back Obama-era policies and decades of government waste. But because as president, he gets to select federal judges who will serve our country for decades to come. Donald Trump, a strong conservative, is picking true constitutionalists who will uphold the law of the land. Now we are learning that two unlikely congressmen have made Trump's job of appointing judges all the more effective. From CNBC President Donald Trump should give special thanks to two U.S. Senators this Thanksgiving weekend. One is still serving in the Senate, the other recently retired. Late last week, Grassley decided not to honor a Senate tradition of holding up hearings for judicial nominees who aren't cleared by their own home state senators. That tradition is known as the blue slip courtesy born out of time before nationwide communication technology when a given state's senators had access to much more information about nominees than their colleagues from the rest of the country. Grassley correctly noted that Democrats were now trying to use the blue slips tradition to replace the filibuster, and he's having none of that. And that brings us to the Democrat who provided the initial generous source of President Trump's solid triumph former Senate Majority Leader, and Democrat, Harry Reid. Reid is a major reason this good fortune has befallen President Trump because Reid was the one who killed the filibuster rule for judicial nominees in 2013. And when he killed it, it was gone for good. This might be the most important thing Trump does as president. The judges he appoints will most likely serve for their entire lives, at the very least decades until they retire. These men and women will make major decisions that will affect every American. Instead of radical liberal activists in these seats, we will have people who stick up for the Constitution. Thanks to Grassley, Democrats in Washington won't abuse an outdated rule to prevent the appointments. Even more unlikely was Harry Reid's decision, years ago, to eliminate the filibuster rule. He did it to help Obama and future Democrats. Obviously, he didn't foresee a Republican ever taking the White House. Even more awesome is the fact that Trump will appoint more judges than Obama. That long period of confirmation obstruction has given President Trump a huge number of seats to fill, twice as many as President Obama's also large number of vacancies when he took office in 2009. The Christian Science Monitor reports this is likely the most vacancies for a president to fill in 40 years. And the Trump team hasn't been wasting much time. This is a big win for Trump and the MAGA movement. We will have strong, conservative judges making decisions for years to come, years to come.